It didn't open. Let me try a different combination. No luck. Here's another combination. No dice. Wait, didn't we already try that combo? I'm not sure. I don't remember. Time out. We need to keep track of each combination so we can tell which ones we've tried and which ones we haven't. You're right. And we need a way to be sure we've tried them all. So let's organize our choices. Three knobs. Orange, green, purple. And to make a combination, we match a knob with a key. Red, blue, yellow. But that's only three combos. What happens if we lay them out like this? Cool. Now it's like a grid of possibilities. This one is green knob plus blue key. And this square is purple knob plus red key. A square for every combination, and a combination in every square. I think we're onto something. Three keys by three knobs makes nine squares. Looks like we have nine different combinations to try. The same as the number of knobs, three, multiplied by the number of keys, three. I forgot which combinations we already tried. Let's start over and check off the combinations as we go. Okay. The first combination is orange knob, red key. Wrong combination. Next up, orange knob, blue key. Mark it. Nope, let's try again. This is the last combination. It better work. <laughs> 